As at yesterday evening, Recording Academy Grammy Awards dropped their list of nominees for their 63rd Grammy Awards, which will be broadcast by CBX live on Sunday 31st, 2021, and hosted by the Daily Show host, Emmy Award winner and Grammy-nominated Travi Noah. With Beyoncé having the highest nomination from nine different categories, Taylor Swift's Dua Lipa and Roddy Rich having six nominations each dominates the Grammy. Beyoncé's Black is King is a film that alighted black arts, music, history and fashion is up for the best music film, while Brown Skinger featuring Whiskey, St. John and Blue Ivy is a song dedicated to dark and brown skinned women is nominated for best music video. And with the Nigerian Afro singer and songwriter Whiskey being in the song makes it his first Grammy nomination. Few minutes later, after the list of nominations came out on the Grammy official website, so many artists took the time to congratulate others while others took out time to express their opinion on the nomination, starting with Justin Bieber, who posted a note on his Instagram page saying, To the Grammys, I am flattered to be acknowledged and appreciated for my artistry. I am very meticulous and intentional about my music. With that being said, I set out to make an R&B album. Changes was and is an R&B album. It is not be acknowledged as an R&B album, which is very strange to me. I grew up admiring R&B music and wished to make a project that would embody that sound. For this not to be put into the categories, feels weird considering from the calls to the melodies to the vocal style all the way down to the hip hop drums that were chosen, it was undefinable, unmistakably an R&B album. To be clear. I obviously love pop music, it just wasn't what I set out to make this time around. My gratitude for feeling respected for my work remains I and I'm honored to be nominated either way. With the caption he said, please do not mistake this as me being ungrateful. They are just my thoughts, take them or leave them. Thank you to the people who fought for me to even having any nominees. Eminem also took on his Instagram page to post the best rap album nominees with the caption So happy for At Rush the 59 and Allen the Chemist on their Grammy Rap Album of the Year nominees. Seems like Recording Academy might be starting to get it right. T.I. wasn't left out. He posted a short video of him announcing this smoke as the winner of the Netflix music competition show Rhythm and Flow in 2019. D smoke with the caption love it when a plan comes together D smoke you end every moment you are enjoying right now you work hard and push yourself and your art above and beyond expectations Cara B chance the rapper and I saw something special in you and you've proven right ever since Love and respect, little bro. Congratulations on your two Grammy nominations. I know. Hashtag Inglewood. Proud AF. Salute. And for the record, this smoke was nominated for Best Rap Album and Best New Artist of the Year. Dua Lipa also tweeted, This doesn't feel real. Six Grammy nominees. What is this life? I can't believe it. Six. My heart is racing and I'm in total shock. I'm beaming and feasing. Thank you so much for all the love and the support. Thank you at Recording Academy. Being nominated is the best part of the Grammys. Winning or losing is inconsequential. Music is subject. Nothing is inherently better than nothing else. Congratulations to every nominee this year. Thank you for making music that has meant so much to me and to so many. How lucky are we? Fairness. The Savage Queen also tweeted, Hotties, let's celebrate the Grammy nominations and my new album. Drop your cash app and hashtag good news Megan to win some dollar signs. Mega the Stallone. I am a Grammy nominated artist. I am in the puddle of tears in my bed after being woken up and told I am nominated as best new artist. My mom at the beginning of the year wrote in an intention book for me to be nominated for a Grammy. Mom, you've always been and are my biggest fan. Thank you. I love you so much. Thank you to my team and my Cyrus. 
Thank you to everyone who took part in the making of the end of everything EP. Thank you PJ for always being there for me and making me feel like my best self as a person and artist. Thank you beyond measures to the Recording Academy for listening and truly hearing my music. This is such an honor and I am utter shocked. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I truly can't believe it. My mind is going a thousand miles a minute and I am beyond grateful and full of joy and gratitude. I know my grandma is looking down on me and this is from her. Thank you, mommy. I wish you could be here for this. Noah Cyrus. Thank you at Recording Academy for the 2021 Grammy nominations for Everyday Life, Album of the Year, Best Recording Package, Coldplay. Deep Reverence, Love. Thank you at Nipsey Hustle, at Heat Boy, at Recording Academy, Big Sean.